purr. Everyone thought the space race ended decades ago, but in 2025, it's back, bigger and faster than ever. This time, it's not just about planting a flag, it's about controlling the future. Right now, the world is quietly splitting into two massive space alliances. On one side, you have a powerful Russia-China partnership, planning joint missions, and a permanent moon base, PAN. On the other side, the United States, Europe, Japan, and Canada are uniting under a NASA-led program to build long-term lunar infrastructure. So why is everyone obsessed with the moon again? Simple, resources and power. The moon holds rare materials that could fuel future technologies. Whoever builds the first permanent base controls research, mining rights, and crucial space trade routes. Both sides are racing to finish orbital stations, fuel depots, and robotic miners. This isn't science fiction. It's happening right now. This new space race will decide who controls satellite networks, deep space communication, and the future of space travel. The world is heading back to the moon, not just for exploration, but for power. S. The race that starts today will shape the next century. Follow for more daily global updates.